is Movie Tone. Geoffrey Shirley reporting. Brescia, start and finish of the Mille Miglia, a thousand miles to Rome and back again. At the start, the ill-starred Marquis de Portago driving a Ferrari. Peter Collins, the 26-year-old ace, also in a Ferrari. Another Ferrari with Piero Taruffi, the eventual winner at the wheel. In a Maserati, Sterling Moss, who was first in 1955, but retired soon after the start. To maintain the schedule of the Mille Miglia, cars travel at up to 180 miles an hour, often on bad roads with additional hazards from crowds of spectators. Peter Collins, who led up to the last stage, retired only 140 miles from the finish. Piero Taruffi took the lead and went on to win. The greatest tragedy was the death of De Portago. An amateur cameraman photographed the aftermath of the crash where 12 people, including the Marquis and his co-driver, were killed. It happened only 25 miles from the finish. There's been a public outcry for the banning, or at least the modification, of the race. Taruffi maintained an average of nearly 97 to take first place at his 15th attempt. A fantastic achievement for a man who is over 50. The International Hairdressing...